raise awareness of the issues of abandonment, to get to advocate for adoption of children um, and draw attention to this issue is an absolutely phenomenal thing. So, so in the first instance, it's awareness. I just, you know, we always say we raise funds as we raise awareness. And for me, the two things go, go hand in hand. Um, specifically today, we are inviting the public uh, to, to come along on this very, very special Mandela Day. Um, we put out a list of the things that we urgently need for the babies currently in our Durban North home. What are some of these things, Jesse? Well, we, as I said um, in, in a couple of the promos, if you imagine um, children between literally a few hours old and four years old, we really do require on an ongoing basis everything those kids would need. So, medical items, um, you know, things that one would, one would administer to a child, like Calpol or Panada, um, things like um, Infocare formula. Infocare is the preferred formula that we use, Infocare 1 and 2. It's a very high quality but reasonably priced formula. So we've chosen Infocare 1 and 2. Nappies, as much as you need formula, you need nappies. That's what we always say. Um, so the nappies, all sizes. Um, baby washers, wet wipes, that's any small thing that could be used. But then things that you might not think about. We go through so many cleaning products. Handy and asbestos, um, domestos, sunlight, liquid, black bags. And then food items for our, our, our toddlers, tin food, um, treats for them. We love to give treats. So things like custards and jellies and things like that. Um, cereals, Rice Krispies, biscuits, chips, flings, all of that kind of stuff. So one of, just to say that one of our things with, with our work is that we want there to be a sense of abundance in these children's lives. We do not run orphanages. That's not what this is. These are homes, they're families, where we lavish these kids. I mean, you know, I sometimes say to Joe, who's our crisis mum, you know, that I think these kids get you know, more ice cream and chips than, than, than I ever used to. But that's important because of the sense of abundance. Long life milks, purities. And then for our days, we've got two, a couple of kids that are actually going to preschool. Right. So people who could help with preparing a school lunch or bringing some biscuits or, or raisins or whatever. It's really that broad range of, of needs which we need on an ongoing basis. So people can think beyond the nappies and the formula and the wet wipes. We need all of that. But if you're going to bless a child with a, a treat of a bunch of flings, we'd be grateful for that. That would be awesome. Our collection board is now open here at the M1 studio in CSABC. Uh, and the collection is on from now until 3 p.m. Uh, this afternoon. So please come and say, uh, say hi to us, uh, please donate as Justin was saying, whatever it is, uh, we've already mentioned on the list, whatever is possible for you, whatever suits your pockets. Uh, we are here today at the M1 studio at the SABC, this is the lunch break, you are listening to Lotus FM, I'll be catching up with Justin Foxton again in just a bit.